Hey guys, Camille Lambert, field agronomist for Kentucky and Southern Indiana. Today I'm here with Brandon Summers. He is the PFR location lead for Kentucky. We want to talk to you about fungicide. It's a little bit far off, but as we're going through the 2020 PFR book, it's things that we're already thinking about for this new growing season. Yeah, so we've done a lot of testing over the years with fungicide within PFR. Uh, one of the tests that we've done for several years is looking at a V5 application, a VT application, and then a combination of the two. And what we've seen is that V5 application just typically doesn't provide us real good return on investment. Like, But our VT application is typically one that we can pretty well count on being uh, fairly good for our pocketbook. So Camille, sure. can you explain why that is? Yeah. So, you know, we talk about a V5 corn plant. It's not very big. And the way fungicides work is they are going to move with the xylem. So they're just going to move outward on the plant. Most of the fungicides that we deal with last 7 to 21 days, some a little bit more but we think about you know what we're protecting against and that's foliar diseases a lot of the times and so by the time this, most of those foliar diseases move in it's going to be later season and so that protection just isn't going to last which is probably why we don't see a great return on investment yeah which is probably why we saw some results that we did out of a, another fungicide timing study we did this past year for the first time we looked at two newer products veltima and mirvis neo uh, we sprayed them at v10 and at r1 and what we saw was that V10 application just really didn't provide us a very good return on investment like our R1 application did. But we did have a pretty hot, wet, and humid August that yeah. was very conducive for those late season diseases you were talking about. Yeah. So we think about how long it lasts. You know, we get southern rust down here that moves in. We've got to be protected. So I'm really excited for 2021. We're actually testing a brand new fungicide. It's called Zyway. The active ingredient is flu triafol but it's soil applied. And the way that it's going to work is that plant, every time it takes up water and takes up nutrients, it's gonna be taking up that active ingredient because it has a really good soil persistence. So do you wanna tell us a little bit about that study? Yeah, so we're gonna look at that uh, fungicide in several different ways. Uh, one, we're gonna look at it in furrow. We're gonna look at it two by two by two. Um, we're also gonna look at it compared with a foliar application late season, trying to cover, get a little extra protection for those late season diseases. Yeah, so you'll have to stay tuned for that study or come on a PFR tour this year. Yep, we thank you for joining us today and we encourage you to like and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to your local Bex representative. Thanks. Thank you.